Well, here's a new business to get into. <laughs> the e-sports. That's right, e-sports. I don't know why they call it a sport. Just sit on your butt. <laughs> it's not for exercising, but e-sports is gaming. You know, look at it. <laughs> it's going to top a billion dollars. That's how much you know, business is going into e-sports now in, in, in the world, actually. And it's growing every year. Uh, and it's one of the big growth. It's sort of like the weed business. Well, now you have the e-sports business. So there's all kinds of opportunities. You don't have to be a gamer yourself. But, you know, this is a, a, a way to make money on all kinds of things. You want to develop games. You're an IT person. Or you just want to organize parties or anything. It's, okay, here from 18 to 22, I mean, from 2018 to 2022, it went from, you know, 800 million to look at this, almost $2 billion. It's gonna be $2 billion, close to that, by 20, uh, 2022. Uh, and the growth of it, look how many people play, you know, uh, over, what is it? You know, it started 33, uh, 300 million in 1917. In 2000, I mean, 2017 was uh, 300 million. Now it's close to 500 million and going up to 600 and some million. Uh, it, it, and it, it's just a booming time, you know, that, that people are doing this. And what, here, here's this sort of like, look at how many people play. You know, 65% of American, adult Americans, okay? 65 adult Americans play video games, 65%, <laughs> wow. <laughs> and so that's a big business. Yeah. Uh, now, so you could go back and get trained in this. There was an article uh, by NPR about what's going on in Ohio State because some people say, "Oh, we can, <coughs> you know, train people to pay, play video games or make video games or run video games and all this kind of stuff." No, we're above all that. Well, that's nonsense. I mean, you know, they train accountants. They this is part of, uh, of it's a growth field. I mean, you want to be a massage therapist, well, you can be in the game industry too and get it. And look at up to $75,000 in scholarships you could get to go back to school and <laughs> become an e gamer expert, you know, organize games, anything. This is an animation career review. This is a website that tries to keep track of what colleges offer, you know, opportunities like this. So at, at 30 or 40, you start a whole new career, 50, 60, 70, look, I'm 70. Man, <laughs> in 20 years, e-sports e may be gone. What the hell? You, you just start a whole new career doing this stuff. You know, and that's why but you, it may need training or just get in the business, volunteer, do anything to see this grow. Because if it's growing, that means people are going to be making money and it's going to be easier to do if there's not a lot of experts. In 10 years, you'll need a PhD in e-gaming. <laughs> now they're trying to convince colleges to even give out a bachelor's degree in it. Uh, but they are. And look at all the universities that do it already. Big name, Miami University, Marquette, that's where I went. <laughs> uh, Kent State, you know, uh, uh, Ohio Northern University, uh, Hawaii Pacific. Now, wouldn't that be good? Go to Hawaii and, stay, <laughs> and study e-sports. Uh, unless it's a mem uh, Let's Go Help member, what I'll do too is tell me what state you're in. I'll show you how to get, you know, free money and help to train for any kind of job, whether it's e-sports or you know, you want to be an IT person, you want to be a massage therapist or, or in the healthcare industry or whatever, a lot of training money to help you like eSports here, up to $76,000, you know, uh, to become an expert in this, you know, and uh, hundreds of millions of people, billions of people, you know, are, are playing these things. You know? And so there's an infrastructure and a way to make money and all this. So if it's something you'd like, like you're a golfer, wouldn't it be great? To make money around golf, maybe you're not a good golfer. It doesn't matter. But there's so many, you know, uh, jobs within the industry to do this. And so it's the same way with esports. You don't have to be a, you know, a, a, a magician playing esports. You could be in the industry. You know, and, and, and that's right. So no matter what state you're in, you know, on Let's Go Help, just tell me, hey, Let's Go, I want to know about training for a better job. And I live in Pennsylvania, you know, and I'll send you a report of all the programs in your state to get started. Now, it doesn't have everyone because like, damn, there's so many, but it's a good place to get started. And there's about 30 or 40 pro programs there, how to get money and help to start a new career, anything you want, you know, that's the thing, whether it's healthcare or 
or just being an IT person, or um, it doesn't matter what. There's so many things to do in life, and we need so many people uh, and people with the training. And it's not getting a degree. It maybe just takes six months, and you get trained for something new and something that starts you on a new career, something that's growing, not something that's shrinking. That's what you want to do. <laughs> You're going to live at least another 10, 20 years, right? Maybe 30, 40, maybe 50. <laughs> We're living so goddamn long. That's the problem with this country. <laughs> People are living so long. <laughs> so let me help you at Let's Go Help.